He says he does not want his alma mater to be involved or used in fuel in crisis in River State. And so, Governor Yesom Wike has decided to draw the attention of the Vice Chancellor and Management of the University of Port Harcourt to what he says is a plot to use lecturers from the institution to compromise the March 19 court ordered state and national assembly rerun election. While the Vice Chancellor, which is required, which I know, is supposed to submit list to INEC, now that was hijacked by one Dr. Otue Bayon, whom you handed over the list to. And who can I with Dr. Dawari George, who is a candidate of APC, and then try to prepare the list which was given to you to sign without your knowing? While pledging to support the effort of the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, and the Buhari administration to enthrone free and fair election in Nigeria, Governor Yesom Wiki, however, says he will not condone the situation where academics who should be seen as bastions of morality and good conduct deliberately assist in compromising the process. To forestall any breakdown of law and order in the state, the governor wants the University of Potaka to call its staff involved in the plot to other. Nobody should rig election for us who are not interested. What we want is free and fair election. But if any lecturer is working for the interests of a political party without you knowing and comes that day to rig this election, whatever that happens to the lecturer is not my business. Because I will not fold my hands and I will not allow it to happen. Except the person who rig and right that is running away, he will no longer be a lecturer in the University of Puerto Rico, a worker. But while the person is in, in this state, we will never, never allow him. The River State government says it has already written to the Independent National Electoral Commission seeking redress on the matter. E. Degwa Biakame, AIT News Patakat.